Hello, this is the Ramblings of an Undisciplined Mind podcast for Friday, December 18th, 2015. So, you know, last week, or maybe the week before, we finally got our, our, our um, leaves raked up. We had a lot of leaves. They did about... Uh, the people we hired did about 30 bags of leaves. And I was a little worried because they were clearing it up. I think the 30th was the day they came but, but, uh, and did it. But uh, the typically the garbage company stops picking up those lawn bags with, with lawn refuse around... You know, right at the end of November. But we've had a very late autumn, so I was hoping they pushed it late. I was very glad to see that they they did pick them up the following Tuesday. So now, you know, we're ready for snow. And so then the following weekend, which was last weekend, I think, I was at Home Depot. Ooh. I was at Home Depot, and I got... I got... Uh, a set of these of these uh, stakes that you're supposed to put on the end of your driveway, and it shows you know, and they got a reflector on them, and, and so I stuck them in the ground uh, at the end of the driveway near the curb for a couple reasons. Number one, it'll help me when I'm clearing snow because I'll be able to see because the driveway kind of flares out a little bit there at the end, so I can see where I've got to do that. And I'm also hoping it's going to help the snow plow driver to know. You know, hey, uh, you know, where is the curb? Because sometimes we're really bad about that, and we end up with a very narrow road, and we don't have a very narrow road the rest of the year. But I put these things up, and, and you know, and, and I felt a little silly doing it, but, I, but you know, it was like the 10th or something. I'm just like, you know, I shouldn't... Actually, it was the 12th. It was, it was last Saturday. You know, I shouldn't feel silly here. It is mid... December and I'm putting these these sticks up and and I'm not the only one that's got there are some sticks like that up but it's just like every time I see them I'm like wow did I really need to get those because we don't have any snow yet <laughs> so I, I it, it is and then it feels and then when I think about it it feels silly to me that I'm feeling embarrassed that I've got these sticks up and we don't have any snow uh So, yeah. Uh, yeah. It's not that I want snow. It's not that I love snow. Snow it just causes work for me. So, I'm not necessarily, you know, ordinarily happy, you know, or, you know, happy that we get snow. You know, I will say that, you know, I would like it to snow uh, late Christmas Eve. See, my, my preferred wet method of snow is late Christmas Eve, it snows, yeah, a couple inches, enough to cover everything. Christmas Day, and it can even maybe be the day before, you know, the 23rd. Uh, I'm okay with that. And it sticks around through Christmas Day, and then on the 26th it melts. And then you're done for the winter. That is my, that is my optimal winter. Um, uh, you know, just have a little for window dressing for Christmas, and then the rest of the time, don't need it. Uh, unfortunately, I live in Michigan, so that's not too likely to happen. Yeah. So, yeah. Getting ready for the snow. I've got the snowblower. I, yeah, a couple weeks ago, I got the snowblower out, and put gas in it, and made sure it started up, and everything worked. You know, usually that alone is enough to get snow flying, is if you get all your, all your winter stuff out. And then, and then, you know, nature says, well, if you're ready for snow, let me give you snow. You know, I wouldn't want to disappoint. Uh, and we had, we had one in November, we had one snowfall that I think lasted for all of 36 hours. And that's all we've got. So. I think we're going to have a mild winter. The, what I'm hearing is, I think there's a. El Nino or something that's going to give us a mild winter, which probably means next year will be nuts. But we'll see. 
You know, there's a lot of winter left to go yet. Um, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna mark it down as a mild winter yet because I don't want to tempt fate <laughs> in that regard. Uh, Lordy, but I'm working from home today. Uh, I'm actually running to Kroger's. I've been watching the Batman movies. The, the Christian Bale Batman movies. And I, I've got Batman Begins. And I've got The Dark Knight. And I do not have The Dark Knight Rises. So I'm renting that. From a box. So I'm, I'm, I'm driving over to Kroger's. To go get. Uh, to go get some. Uh, get some uh, cookie making stuff. Daughter and I are making cookies tonight. And then pick up the movie. I reserved it this morning, so yeah, that's kind of what the day is like. Anyway, I guess I'll, I will end this today, uh, and uh, I will be back tomorrow, probably after, definitely after I've seen Star Wars. So I'll give you my feelings on that. Uh, well, they're fresh in my brain, because stuff in there spoils really fast. So anyway, I will be back tomorrow, and I'll be talking to you then. So, be seeing you.